<laughs> oh, she's stung by the bee. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And before I start to watch this video, please support and also join me on my Patreon so you can enjoy anime reaction videos with anime screen and sound and also without ads. And now I'm going to watch Kumo de Suga Nanika episode 11, so let's check it out. Tabu menu. <laughs> Okay, what are these? It's like a list of skills. Okay, this is Kumo sound. Oh, look at that! <laughs> okay, she got new armor. Okay, next time is the big battle. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> if this episode is gonna show uh, another big battle because I think all of the battle in Kumo's life are big battles <laughs> because uh, she needs to survive oh that's soon and Faye Okay, Faye is getting bigger now. <laughs> okay, did he hit someone? Oh, it's Faye. I think he still feels sad about Julius. Okay, for a packet, that means okay, Faye is somehow Shun's uh, familiar. Oh, I think they are using magic. Okay, it's like uh, making contract. Oh, okay, forging pack. Okay, so that means uh, Faye will always stay beside him. Okay, what happened to Faye? She turned into an egg? Oh, maybe she's going to evolve? Oh yes, <laughs> now evolving. Okay, it's like a, a, a Digimon. <laughs> Tabu level 10. So that's what happened to her. Okay, so suddenly she got so many information. It's like the giant library. Okay, after she reads a uh, tabu skill level 10. Okay, 
if nothing changes, this world is totally doomed. Yeah, to be honest, I like her new armor, okay? It looks so badass. <laughs> okay, that's <laughs> her next target. <laughs> <laughs> they are bleeding Okay, so her objective is to save the world. <laughs> okay, after learning all of the information from that library, and now she wants to defeat Araba the Earth Dragon. Oh, okay, she just teleport into the lower stratum, and she's going to find that Earth Dragon. <laughs> Uh, oh, it's a there. <laughs> okay, it's a different monster. Okay, it's like a a king cobra. <laughs> okay, she's so scared of this monster. Maybe, uh, okay, this is beyond her power. Okay, she's she's not going to do anything with that giant snake. that Araba is fighting with this giant snake okay, I think it's a good idea so let them just kill each other so in the end we just need to defeat one monster and oh okay, Araba just died gravity magic wow this snake is so strong okay but but oh my god okay that's so badass <laughs> okay it's so brutal okay so Araba still won't give up Oh, okay. Now it's biting the snake's body. Okay, that means Araba is far stronger than the snake. Oh, okay. Oh, I think he's uh, biting the snake into pieces. Oh, she's admiring this dragon's power. Look at that. <laughs> she's blushing. <laughs> okay, so Araba is still the real boss. Okay, not that purple snake. Okay, how will she defeat that Araba? Okay, because it's definitely on different level. Yeah, this dragon is so fierce and also very powerful too. Okay, we're back to the human world. Okay, Hyrins is uh, Julius's friend. Okay, the only survivor from that team.
Okay, what happened between him and Julius? And maybe in the battlefield, Julius saved his life. Oh! Okay, Phoenix Feather. He just died in the game. Oh, Julius gave this feather to him. Yeah, now he feels guilty after Julius's death. She appeared. Oh, okay. Is that the demon lord? Okay, so this lady is the one who killed Julius. A rot attack. Okay, so Julius's body turned into ash after being attacked by this skill. Look at these kids here, they are so adorable. Okay, this is <laughs> when they were still kids. This is so sad. <laughs> okay, and now she has to be the next hero okay, to replace Julius. Oh, Harris will protect him. Okay, that rot attack okay, reminds me of uh, Kumo skill. Okay, we're back to Kumo again, and I think she's uh, <laughs> she's attacking a frog. Okay, I thought it was Araba. Oh, okay, she's leveling up. Oh, okay, she's injured. <laughs> Okay, that rot attack. Okay, it's the same attack that that lady used to Julius. Okay, wait, that lady, it's not Kumo, right? Okay, and how come that Kumo <laughs> turned into a human? Yeah, I'm just curious because they got the same skill. 
two of them and she's going to fight two dragons <laughs> okay she just teleport to her house oh, okay she marked them okay so she can track the dragons like <laughs> like uh, in the gps Okay, that's her plan. <laughs> okay, she's going to attack Araba while it's sleeping. Okay, so she's going to defeat all of these hornets first. I can fly. Okay, she just need to float while fighting Araba, so the dragon cannot use the gravity magic. Oh! <laughs> oh, she's stung by the bee. <laughs> she wants to learn some ability from this this oh they this horrid is this <laughs> I keep <laughs> attacking her This horror is so persistent. <laughs> oh, okay, she just destroyed the hornet. <laughs> oh, and now she's going to kill all of the hornets and clear the battleground. Oh, this is so efficient. Get to kill the hornets. What is this? <laughs> oh, okay. Another tutorial about magic. So her plan is to use this black magic, a special and heretic magic. <laughs> and 
Hey, but now she's still leveling up, so uh, she can defeat Araba later. And I think she just defeat all of the Hornets. And what is this? Okay, is this the queen or something? Because ah, okay, it looks bigger. Uh, oh, dang! She got step. Oh, after image. <laughs> just after image oh, and there are still so many of these hornets oh that's the hive okay maybe we should destroy that one destroy their house <laughs> okay, she's going to blow the house Okay, she just destroyed the hornet's hive. <laughs> Damn, this is genocide. <laughs> and now she's going to eat all of the hornet's corpse. <laughs> Damn, she's so overpowered. Lost. Okay, what kind of skill is that? Okay, there's no ending song, so I think this episode is kind of special. Okay, maybe that's Araba. <gasps> okay, it's that Earth Dragon. Okay, my battle has only just begun. <laughs> okay, I cannot wait to see what will be happening in the next episode, but I think the next episode will be very amazing because uh, at the end of this episode, Kumo was attacking Araba. <laughs> okay, he just strike uh, Araba right away okay, after she leveled up by killing those hornets and clear uh, the battlefield. And also, I'm thinking about the lady uh, that wore the white dress, okay, the one that was using the rod, attacked to Julius and turned him into ashes. Okay, is that person has relation with Kumo because why uh, she also got that rod attack? Okay, or maybe in the future Kumo will be getting subordinates or something. <laughs> okay, I am still thinking about that one. And also I still feel bad for Shun because uh, he looks still sad about Julius and Okay, he has no choice but to become the next hero and also he forged pact with uh, Fei too so that means Fei will always stay beside him and become uh, his partner in the battlefield okay, but okay, I cannot wait to see the fight between Kumo and Araba because it's gonna be very interesting and I think all of the fight uh, in Kumo's life all uh, are all big fights because <laughs> every time she fights of course uh, she fights for uh, her life and also she needs to survive in this place Okay, so thank you guys for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and also support me on Patreon. See you again in my next video. And later.